welcome to Tiger Talk. I'm your host, Musa, and I'm a senior here at SMSA. For our first segment today, we have Janavi with an update on school sports. Take it away. In this Tiger Talk, we'll be giving an update on school sports. Our school is currently doing some winter sports such as boys and girls basketball as well as indoor sports like track. So far, the boys varsity basketball team has begun their season and won their first game against Sefford High School, winning 54-43. to Senior Ashri Bogart scored 23 points and had 6 steals, while Elon Monroe scored 21 points and had 7 steals. And on Friday, they claimed their second victory over East Granby, winning 78-38, to with senior Jack Way Moore scoring 15 points, senior Elon Monroe scoring 14 points, 6 assists, and 5 steals. And lastly, senior Ashri Bogart scored 18 points and had 3 steals. The girls' basketball team played their first game at home this Monday the 15th against Berlin High School, where they lost 50-27. to It was a good effort on the girls' part. Back to the studio. Now we will be moving on to Jack Seal with highlights from the Super Bowl. What is the Super Bowl, you might ask? The Super Bowl is the annual championship game of the NFL. The Super Bowl took place in Tampa Bay, Florida on February 7th in a matchup between Kansas City Chiefs and the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. It was one of the best matchups between arguably the greatest quarterback of all time and the greatest quarterback in the future of the NFL. This Super Bowl was a special one since this one was the first time in history that a team has played at their home stadium. It also was special because since it was a deciding factor on whether Tom Brady needed Bill Belichick, he was also going for his seventh ring which we, he had won and now holds the most rings in the NFL history by any player and also has more Super Bowl wins than any franchise. Tom Brady had previously won six with the Patriots. The teams with the second most wins are the Patriots and the Steelers with six, six each. The Super Bowl wasn't even close, seeing that Tom Brady and Rob Gronkowski could not be stopped winning their fourth Super Bowl together. The Chiefs let us down in the Super Bowl. Although Mahomes tried his best to bring the team back, he had no receivers open and had no time to throw it, since the O-line was nowhere to be found. Does this mean that Tom Brady is the greatest of all time? Let us know your thoughts on this. Thank you, Jack Seal, for the highlights. I would say from that report, it would be impressive to see if Tom and Rob could pull off another ring next year, but I guess we'll just have to wait. Although we have to wait to see if Tom and Rob can pull off another ring, we don't have to wait for the results of Trump's second impeachment. Here's Abby with an update on that. Hi, my name is Abby Bellows, and in this segment, I will be discussing the impeachment of former U.S. President Donald Trump. Former President Trump has a spotty past with violent attacks and encouraging them, to say the least. Uh, in 2017, he encouraged a white supremacist rally in Virginia, and most recently, on January 6th, as we all know, he encouraged an attack on the Capitol building. Because of this, he is on trial to be impeached. So, he is the first president in U.S. history to A, ever be impeached after his presidency has ended, and B, be impeached twice in his presidency. Republicans are struggling to acquit the president without excusing his actions, which is a lot harder than it seems. On February 13th, the U.S. Senate vote was 57 to 43, which led to Trump being acquitted from the charges that he was facing due to feeble defense by his lawyers that amounted to a little more than gaslighting and a presentation of falsehoods. Who knew you could be on trial for impeachment for a second time? Thank you, Abby, for the latest report on that trial. Thank you to all of our reporters today. What a crazy month it has been. Well, that's all we have for you today. We hope everyone watching is being safe. We wish you all the best this semester. We look forward to seeing you all next time.